Hi everybody, John Boutte, Buffalo Sports Museum. In the vault. Just got done filming this segment that we're gonna do today and it, uh, for some reason, filmed sideways. So we're gonna have to reshoot it. Don't know what happened, but we'll do it again for you because I love doing this stuff. Um, we've been doing card sets lately to some really great reviews. Bill sets, Brave sets, Sabres sets. And I thought we would move into the oldest professional sport here in Buffalo, the Buffalo Bisons. As everybody knows, the Bisons date back to the late 1800s and um, have lots of cards from the, the Bisons era. Uh, these ones are extremely old. These date back all the way back to turn of the century, the last century, 1909. And this set is called the T206 Tobacco Card Set, uh, manufactured by the American Tobacco Trust and um, covered not only uh, international baseball league, minor leagues, uh, but also professional. And uh, many of you might have uh, seen this set featured before because of one particular card, the Hannes Wagner card, uh, probably the most famous baseball card in existence. And uh, that was in this set. This is not a real Hannes Wagner, it's a replica, because if I had a real one selling for three, four million dollars, I would be retired. But I'm not retired yet, and I love doing what I do. So we're gonna talk a little bit more about these cards. This set, uh, you would get this set if you were of the age of buying tobacco, cigarettes, and they would put one card into each pack, and that's how you would get the cards. Over 500 cards in the set, and uh, in the Bison set, there are 11, and uh, we have them all, and it was a fun set to put together. Um, because the, the cards are just so beautiful. I think the artwork and color on these are just absolutely phenomenal. These are not pictures, these are these are artists' renderings of pictures. And they did a just a beautiful job with these. I just love them. I love the, the, the color and the, the, uh, the poses. So it's a really nice set and hard to find in top condition. Seeing they're 100 and what, 12, 13 years old, Hard to find in top condition. Most of my cards are in the three, four, two PSA range, which still nice looking cards. Um, but as you see, they'll have ring wear, little corner rounding, off center, um, marks, things of that nature. But a really, really cool set to have and great to put together. Very difficult to put together. And uh, we're going to move on to a couple years later, 1912, three years later. This set is called the Imperial Card Set, C46. And this one specifically dealt with the International League. So this set had teams from Buffalo, Rochester, Syracuse, Toronto, um, Jersey City, Newark, uh, in them, and it's a really, really nice set of cards. I just love them, and they. I don't. I, it's one of those sets of cards that just doesn't get its due, and I don't know why. Because it's it's such a pretty set. It just looks old. It just uh, the 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 framing, that little portrait, like you're looking at a uh, a work of art, and I just love it. They're a great set. Great set to put together. Again, most of my cards are in. Uh, PSA 4 or 3, uh, some 2s, because they are very difficult to find in great shape. Like I said, being that old is just, wow, amazing that they're even ex still in existence. And then I brought out uh, some a set from 1958, a little closer to home, age-wise. This was about five years before I was born. 
And this set uh, was produced, uh, it's a regional set here in Western New York by Bond Bread. Some of the older collectors might remember Bond Bread here in Buffalo. And uh, this set of cards was uh, produced to honor the 1958 Bison team. Best card in this set by far is the Luke Easter. And uh, this is our very desirable Near Mint Mint 8. And these cards are really not that easy to find in great shape. I, have, I happen to have some really nice ones, 8s and 9s in this set, but um, not as easy to put together as you would think. The paper was very thin. Obviously the white card started to turn a little brown, a little gray, but uh, it's a really nice set of cards. One of my favorite sets of cards. So pretty. And just, uh, you know, you could tell from the era by the jerseys and the caps. So, um, Love baseball cards, um, love all the cards. We're gonna continue on uh, in the vault. We might get to some more card sets. We gotta go through the 60s bills, which is a really, really unique and fun time in, in um, Buffalo sports history. I think you'll love that segment. And uh, we're gonna go on from there, but um, love talking about the Bisons. Uh, as you know, I'm a big baseball fan and um, like I said, it's it's just it's a great, great sport. Baseball is it's such a wonderful sport here in Buffalo and around the globe. So we're gonna uh, we're gonna turn off for today. Hope you like the segment. Hopefully this video turns out the right way, and uh, we'll see you next time in the vault. Have a great night. Bye now.